Man, I must be going nuts today. I'm sitting in the, uh, at a cafeteria. I'll let you see where I'm sitting at. I'm sitting out uh, having breakfast uh, here in a restaurant in the East Village. Uh, and the rain is raining. I find it quite interesting as I sit here and have my breakfast in the rain. It's just uh, things that... Um, the, the rain does something to the tree that scientists have spoke of. And you can feel it when you sit out in the rain. You become more creative, and that's because the oxygen is being filtered by the rain and allow you to breathe in clear, clean oxygen. And it also allows you to think better than you were before it rained because of what you're breathing in does this. I noticed it in Vietnam when during the monsoon that when it was really hot and sticky, the mind could think of a way out. But when it's starting to rain, you could see the way out. And I said, in the rain, this is something that I've been doing since the war. I noticed that, and uh, sometimes I try to keep some things to myself because people really think you're crazy. But even those with allergies, when it rains, the allergy kind of disappears. It's kind of like the rain and the oxygen blending that you're breathing sends the body into a tailspin that never were, especially those who have allergies. And so those with allergies, what um, it, it, if, if it could rain every day for them, that's good. But it can't rain every day because the, 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 the planet, the, the earth, you know, uh, has a way of feeding its resources, such as flowers and trees. And... Sometimes those who we vote for should pay attention to the planet and how the planet makes sure that every tree, branch, insect eat. So what I'm really trying to say is that we have a hunger crisis no one is paying attention to. And I'm sorry to take you through all of this, but I had to start from the top and come down to end up at the hunger crisis that we're suffering uh, from. That they're totally being ignored by man. Man is destroying self because these things are critical to the human species that is really being ignored and not paying any attention to at all. Because of all these problems, the greed of what? Hunger is a very critical resource the body needs. But in the meantime, I will let you see how one who created this planet go about feeding the planet as what we should be focused on with each other. Through the rain, they call it earth food. Even though the traffic is passing and people are standing hailing cabs, it's raining. The earth is feeding the planet through the rain that has minerals and other resources in it that we may not name, we not, may not know about. Uh, scientists, even themselves, has not tested the full function of the rain to see what minerals and other resources it carries. But it, it, it's devastating to, to really consume this. The human body consume this rain, this element. It's an awesome, awesome, awesome thing. Something unfolding right before your eyes and how the human species became who we are. And rain had a lot to do with it. It's all in the rain. I just had to share that with you. Once again, this is me. Jimmy McMillan, doing what I do best in the rain. I love you.